We're back, baby! Oh my gosh, are you good? Yes, excellent. Oh, it's so good to be here, guys. Uh, but it does, it turns out that if you're single in your mid to late 30s, sort of already nudging up against that dystopian fallopian phase of your life, and then a pandemic strikes, <laughs> It really puts a dent in some of the plans you had. I just thought I had more time, guys. I thought I had more time. And now I find myself on dating apps again. <laughs> Not because I'm lonely, just because I miss the lies, you know? <laughs> oh, are you 38, Gary? <laughs> because your scrotum would suggest you should be expecting a letter from the Queen any day now. <laughs> Oh, I, I just, I think you're all very smart men, very clever. I just don't think you understand what a woman wants on a dating app. Otherwise, you would surely stop putting photos of yourselves with big dead fish. Just like, yeah, fucking look at that, look at that. He used to be alive and now he's dead. Cause you're all a big, 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 strong boy. I've done a murder on a fishy. <laughs> no. No, we're, we're, we're actively avoiding murder. <laughs> but I matched with this man and we were talking about movies and we'd both recently seen Joker. Yes, we were very late to the party, but you don't find yourself on dating apps in your mid to late 30s because he's someone who's really kept up with the pack. So, <laughs> he said, what did you think of that movie? And I said, I thought it was an interesting way to tell that story. What did you think? And he said, actually, I found it quite predictable. <laughs> Now, I didn't speak my truth. Brene Brown would be very disappointed in me. <laughs> Brene Brown possibly didn't know how very horny I was. So I, I sort of jazzed it up a bit and went, wow, <laughs> that's a really interesting take. <laughs> Maybe we should talk about it over a drink sometime. <laughs> I'm not proud of myself. But if I'd spoken my truth, I would have said, did ya? Did you see the ending coming, did ya? Yeah. Do you reckon that's because um, it's a movie about a man who starts as a man and ends as the Joker and the movie's called Joker? <laughs> Do you think maybe it's because it's an origin story about a character we're all quite familiar with at this point? Do you think it's possible that maybe you're not the prodigal son your mum told you you were and that your incredible intelligence is not that far out in front of the collective consciousness <laughs> and in fact, Oh, no, I knew it was going to sink. Actually, I saw it coming on you, on you. <laughs> I am so sick of pretending men are smart so I can fuck them. <laughs> Thanks so much, guys. Have a good night. <laughs>